Welcome back. For a group of inner city girls growing up in poverty, a recent trip abroad is now transforming their lives. It opened their eyes, as Linda Picaro reports in this week's Visiones. This is a public affairs presentation from For New York, Visiones. A free two-week trip to Honduras has done a world of wonders for several teenage girls. 17-year-old Sasha Davila is now back in New York, as is 16-year-old Dalia Rodriguez, along with the director of the Edgy's Teen Center, Amarillas Perez. Great to see you all, ladies. Hi. Tell me about this experience in Honduras. What did you do down there? Um, well, we worked a lot with the kids that were in a lot of the camps. We had two bilingual camps that we worked at and a Spanish camp, and we helped them with different activities and just interacting and experiencing the culture. And you guys, some are from Lower East Side, Brooklyn. Um, tell me what the experience was like for you. What did you, what did you get out of this? I mean, it, I know, you know life is difficult for you here in the States. What was it like to be there and, and see what these children are going through? Um, it made us appreciate everything that was going on. Like over here, we have um, Medicaid, governments helping us. Um, over there, there's no government just helping them with the poverty over there. The kids are suffering and... Did it change your sense of self-esteem at all? Do you feel like, you know, I mean, it's, it's difficult. Do you feel like you, now you feel like you have something to give? Is, is that the case? Definitely. Like, when I first went there, I didn't have any, like, real confidence. And coming back, it's like you're a different person. You have lots of self-esteem. You believe in who you are, and you believe that you can give others. Well, this is all part of the Edgy's Teen Center. Amarillas, tell us about this program and, and, and what, the, what the goal is. So we started this program as a new initiative at the Educational Alliance. It is a girls empowerment initiative and it is to help our girls transform themselves and in turn to transform the world. So most of our young ladies feel like they have nothing to give in their communities and now they feel like they have something to give coming back from Honduras. And, and this program is continuing, right? It's growing? It will continue this year hopefully and um, we look forward to working with our young girls. And will you ladies uh, maybe try to go back or? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great, ex it must have been a great experience for you. Thank you so much. And thank you, Amarillas, Edgy's Teen Center. Thank you.